Hey, Joyous Lovers, it's your baby girl, Joyous in the building. How are you all doing? I hope you are fine for me. As you can see, I am okay. <laughs> oh, please, if this is your first time you're coming across this channel, please just do me a favor, subscribe, like, and share my, my um subscribe to my YouTube channel, okay? Um, in today's video, we are going to do fried rice, Nigeria fried rice. Mm, are you people ready for that? Yeah. <laughs> Remember, I love you guys so much. For my old and my new subscribers, I love you so much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So guys, let's just dive directly to our video. In today's um, video, um, like I said before, we are doing fried rice nigeria fried rice so my ingredients are here already so let me just take you to my ingredient okay i'm sorry in the first place i have already prepared the ingredients um, behind camera because of time um you all know that fried rice is a lot of work yeah fried rice is a lot of work so for the video to not be too um to not be too long i have to do all the necessary things behind camera and um, we are going to do it okay so let me take you directly to the ingredient love you guys please remember joyous love you first that is my subscribers where is my manners i'm sorry for that my old and my new subscribers remember i love you so much your girl love you Mwah. Mwah. so let's go to the video to the ingredient for these um, our fried rice, our ingredient is here. So I have my liver here. This is my liver. Some people, they use, um, what do they call, um, gizzard. So you can say use gizzard. It doesn't mean that because I'm using, uh, what do they call, liver, you are going to use it. The only difference between liver and gizzard is that if you use liver to prepare your um, fried rice, he will be very soft to chew but um gizzard after frying it he used to be hard to chew that is the only difference it's not if not they are equal after all, if you want to do party um fried rice um you are going to be using um, chicken breast for the party fried rice for the party fried rice so it doesn't matter you must look for what they call liver so i have my liver here i have my green peels here i have my green beans here i have my um bear pepper here the green one this is the green bear pepper this is the red bear pepper and this is the yellow bear pepper you can see my carrot here and this is spring onions yeah this is spring onions and i have my chopped white onions here you can use um red onions and i have my fresh stream there yeah i love to put stream in my fried rice and i have my powder seasoning here and of course you know that my extra vegan olive oil is there and i have two seasoning here so as you can see all the ingredients are complete yeah for some people they say they don't normally put pepper in their fried rice i do i do put pepper okay i do put pepper so in uh, in this pepper i have my crayfish that is my dry crayfish and then um, the pepper here you see so i just blend it rough yeah i just blend it rough so i normally put um pepper in my fried rice some people say they don't put it but i do okay i do so we are going to um start right now the oil i mean, i i used to fry the meat that I'm um, the meat I fry. I'm going to use the oil to fry this. So let's just go directly to the video, okay? I have empty pot here. I'm going to um, I'm going to filter the water I use. Um, that is the stock for the meat. I'm going to filter the water here because it's what I'm going to use to parboil my rice. And at the same time, I'm going I'm going to put my fry pan on the fire with the oil that I fry from the meat. I will use it to fry the liver okay i'm going to use this oil to fry the liver so let's filter 
our water. The stock is here. We are going to filter it together. that it will not allow your rice to look so simple so smooth and nice you'll be having all these um uh, 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 what will i say all this spice you know so our water is on the fire we are going to be adding our curry powder to this water there's no major men just add it to your taste like some people, they normally put color for their fried rice. But me, I don't put color. Because you adding color to your rice, you will end up having green rice, no longer fried rice. Um, then I'm going to add a little bit of powder seasoning. And at the same time, I have, I have my water here inside of this bowl. I'm going to fill it, like sieve this pepper. I don't want the rice to have any anything like stock. Then remember this is pepper and crayfish that I blend. This is pepper and crayfish, and I'm going to use this crayfish for another thing, okay? I just need only the... I like when my rice is so tasty, but it does not have anything like chaps inside. I don't know what to call it, if there is any word like that anyway. But this is the way I like to do my rice. I'll be adding little salt, because I this, um, this meat stock... I use, you know, how we normally boil our meat. We pick, we put, we put everything necessary to boil the meat. So this is my meat stock. I'm going to add a little, a little salt to balance the taste, okay? And then, allow it to boil. At the same time, I'm going to be frying my liver here. I don't know if this oil is hot. Let me check. Okay, it's hot, so... This is my liver going in. We will be back to, um, to check if our water has boiled. Look at the quantity of rice I'm going to cook. Very plenty. <laughs> Very plenty, okay? So, in short, first you need to eat. So look at the quantity of rice. And this fried rice, you must not use, like me now, I'm using um, um, long rice. Yeah, they call it chairman. They call this rice chairman. It's a long white rice. As you can see. Is a long white rice I am using. Feel free to use any rice of your choice, okay? Just feel free to use any rice of your choice. Do not say it's because, um, do not say it, since it's not a long white rice that it's not going to be nice or sweet. It will. Like some people, they don't eat this rice. They eat uh, what they call Uncle Ben's rice. Yeah, they eat it. So I love this one. I fell in love with this rice. So, catch you guys. Our liver is ready now. Let's do it out from the oil. Guys, I'm going to transfer this pot back to the other side. So that I can use this other side to prepare the vegetable okay oh. 
what happened to my light so our oil goes in now Oh yeah, it's hot already. Our oh, water is even boiling. Let me just put the rice. Mind you, this rice has been already washed, follow it, okay? Just to cover our rice and continue with this one. My spring onions goes in now. My carrot goes in. My carrot goes in early because <laughs> other ones are very easy to to get soft or to be soft than the carrot. I'm not going to cover it because I want it to not to overcook it. So I'm not going to cover it, okay? We'll be back. We are putting all our bare pepper at once. The green one goes in. The red one goes in. And the yellow ones goes in. So it's time to stir, guys. Let's do it together. I told you I don't want to cover this um, carrot. So that I won't overcook. Our rice is getting ready. I'll be adding my so you see the reason why I make enough vegetable. Because I know the quantity of my rice is much. Our vegetable has been cooking some time now. So it's okay. Wow. Oh, our rice is set. Wow. Very okay, not too soft, and um, it's not hard. Okay, it's time for us to fry now. I will be bringing down the rice this way, then this one will go here, and our pan is ready. We are at the final stage. 
So I don't know if you can see this very well. This is what I normally use to prepare my fried rice. So you can get this from lead, lead there. That is where I normally got it from. At this point, I'll be testing the rice. If the sauce is enough, or I'm going to add. I need a little bit of salt. And I have my sweet corn here. I hope you know what is sweet corn. Look at how it looks like. I have my sweet corn. Stir it again. And our fried rice is ready. Like I said before, you can decide to add color, okay, to yours. You can decide to add color, but for me, I don't need color. I'm okay like this. I'm going to do this process like two to three times. Then I will do the rest. You know, this um, is um, it's much. So I will do the rest behind the camera. So I'm going to repeat this one like two, three times for you guys to see. That is salt. My sweet corn goes in. You see, because I blend my pepper and the crayfish, I filter it. If I do not filter it, you will be seeing all those things like um, thyme, like a uh, pieces of um, thyme in it. But I don't like that. I like my fried rice to be plain like this, but it will be very delicious. It's ready and good to go. Okay. So remember, I love you guys so much. I love you guys. See you in my next video. Like I said before, the fresh stream is not a must, and the sweet corn is not a must. Okay. Anything you feel like using for your choice, you are free to use it. Just use anything that maybe you love to use. So the sweet corn and the fresh stream is not a must, okay guys?